the reason why I do 100 plus deals and, and most agents don't is because they get caught up on one, two, three, or four clients and they don't try to talk to enough people basically. You know, they don't they don't talk to a large enough volume of people, right? And see what they can do to help those people create those relationships. And then there's not there's really I mean very few people have a really good back end um, system to follow up and stay in touch with people forever. So I think the problem is we're not talking to enough people. And <laughs> like we're just trying to convert every single lead and we're just spending so much time on each lead. Like I showed property yesterday. By the way, I still show every single property, go to every closing, every inspection, all that stuff. Every listing appointment, I do all that. And I was showing property yesterday. It was $200,000 homes. And to some buyers that probably, I don't even know if they can, you know, like, I don't even know if they're, if they can buy or not. It's crazy. But they, you know, like I was thinking about it, like most agents would have taken that two or three hours they spent with that buyer and that would have been their entire day. Like they wouldn't have done anything else, you know, they wouldn't have went back to the office and made some more calls and tried to figure out some more things to try to reach some more people to see who they could help and you know continue building their database and doing all the little things like behind the scenes you know like being a hard worker it means being a hard worker when nobody's watching you you know and i think that's the problem we're just doing what we need to do to kind of look like we're a hard worker or look like we're a successful agent but we're not actually doing the behind the scenes work like that it takes to get to the top you know what i mean so as far as building relationships go I believe in not caring if this prospect in front of me wants to buy or sell anything today or not. You know, like, oh, only go after motivated people. Okay, well, that's about 1%, 2%, 5%, 10% of the people you talk to. It's really motivated. What about the other, like, 20 to 30% of people who like you enough to do a deal they are just not ready yet? Do we just throw those people away? No. That's how I sell 100 properties a year. I have captured everyone whether they want to buy or sell or not yeah I'm taking advantage of the people that are motivated but I'm also taking advantage of the people that aren't motivated for the future because I know those relationships will turn into 10 to 20 deals to me over the life of my career the repeat business referrals and referrals of referrals so I mean I could go on and on and on and on here bro you know what I'm saying